Right on time. Whatever happens, don't move. It'll be cool. I'm just gonna sit here and wait for my man to come back for me. Not here in five, we split. as nervous as you are. Don't tell me I'm nervous. I've been doing this since before you learned how to jerk off. What's that? Ready? No, no, wait a few minutes. Let's let him sweat a little bit. Playing games with us. Trick! Put that shit away. Signal him. If he doesn't answer, we're leaving. We better do it, Frank. Boys ready back there? Yeah. Let's do it. Sure wouldn't. You want to get on with it? Okay. What the hell do you want? <coughs> Where's the stiff? A friend. Where's the product? It's all in there, man. Well, you want to show it to me? You go first. No. You. How long are we going to keep dancing like this? Yeah, well, the fucking dance is over. Huh? Well, now. Isn't this smart, huh? Now we're going to kill each other and no one's going to make no money. What are you doing here? What do you think I'm doing here? Get out of the car. Get the fuck away from me. Oh, fucking shit. Oh, there it is. Take a look. Open it. Fuck you. You open it. All right. Fine. You want to be dead? Mm -hmm. Here's the chance of a lifetime, pal. No! Get Don't off even me! Think about it. Oh. Ah! Go to the van, I'll cover you! 
Slaughtered him. Just so I could watch. Fuck it, bastards! You set us up. Because Adrian's not gonna believe this! Well, he'll believe this. I got their money. Uh, yeah, well, we lost the dope. Uh, I got the dope. Great, we're in profit. Oh, fuck the brother! I gotta get to a hospital! I'm not gonna make it! No! We're going to the boat! He could be dead! I gotta find out what happened to him! And I really don't understand you. You could have got your own self killed back there. Shut up! I ain't listening to you! Well, you gotta listen to me. I'm your brother. The only family you got. It hurts real bad. Just quit your whining. Somebody must have known it was going bad. Shut the hell up. Who could have known it was going bad? They're all dead except us. So where'd you woman get to? What the hell business is it of yours? She got away. How do you know? She got away. I checked the car. When? When? Before? What are you trying to get at? She left! Lucky she got out, man. What'd you want her to do? Jump in there and hit him with her purse? She shouldn't have been there in the first place. Fuck you, man. She was gone before it all started. No, she wasn't. You shut your goddamn lying mouth. You're right. Just get me a doctor. I'm not gonna make it. No kidding. I gotta see if he's on right. Forget about him. Shit, I'm sick of living like a rat in a hole. Oh, when you get a job, we'll get a better apartment. I don't need no job. Well, what are you gonna do? Live off the inheritance? No. I'm gonna live with Gantry. Over my dead body. See, you need to cut this shit out. I can do what I want. I love him, he loves me. He loves you? And what would that little prick know about love? You don't know nothing about him. Well, what do I gotta know? He took you in the middle of some kind of drug deal. What kind of man in his right mind will take you in a place like that? He didn't want to take me anywhere. I wanted to be there. Killing people with some low-life gangster? Well, then you're crazier than he is. Why should I listen to you? Your ass come out the army. Special forces. Big hero. And now what you doing? Driving a cab. Big fucking deal. Top story, a police officer and several suspected gang members killed in a shootout. Turn it up! When we return, Live Eyes Helen Walensky is on the scene at Mount Forest Cemetery as police officers comb through the wreckage. Death! Six, that's one. Stay tuned for final scores at 11.
Sensitive and vulnerable as always. Touch the wrong button, it'd never work again. Yeah, well, neither would you, Jimmy. Just after 4 p.m. this afternoon, a team of police officers involved in an undercover drug buy were attacked. A police officer and six okay, suspects Rossi. were killed. It all took place You're going to be all right? See I'll see you tomorrow. I'm out of here. Right. Catch you later, Jimmy. Frank, I'm really sorry about Wallace. How come it went bad? Look, there'll be a press conference in the morning. You can ask them. Come on, I'm just asking. No mic, no notepad. I've signed off for the night. Helen, I've known you for five years. You've never signed off. That's been the problem. Yeah, well, I'd like to think we've both grown up a bit since then, Frank. Yeah, right. I don't know exactly what you're going through. I just want to help if I can. Yeah, especially if there's a good story in it for you, huh? Hey, that is not fair, Frank. I am just trying to do a hard job the best way that I can, just like you. No, no, it's not the same. You got a hard day, your camera jams. Tonight, I'm going to be sitting in Wallace's living room, looking at his wife's face, watching her whole world cave in. There's a big difference there, Helen. I'm sorry, Frank. Can I drive you back into town? Please? Mr. Kasajian, we'll see you now. When you first came to me, I saw a special strength. It's not always a good sign. They had us set up. I know. Do you know what it is that makes a leader? Sacrifice. Sacrifice yourself, and men will follow you anywhere. Nobody knew. Don't say anything. I just. Wanted you to know. Later tonight, my man will find your lady friend and kill her. What are we doing here, Frank? It's one of Kasajan's joints. Maybe we'll learn something. You know, he never hated anyone. He found something good in the worst slime balls you could imagine. It can make the job easier sometimes. I don't know what I'm going to do. You know, Frank, you're welcome to stop by later if you'd like. You sure that's a good idea? What are you doing here? You don't know how to listen, do you? Tara, go home. Why don't you just beat it, buddy? Why don't you shut up? Get out of here. Why don't you get out of here? Stop it! Frank, aren't you going to do anything? Yeah. I have me another drink. Well, I'm a cop. Hands against the railing. Let's go. What, you figure you're faster than a speeding bullet? Get out of here! 
hate that karate shit. Now, you're under arrest for insulting an officer with that crap. Now, get your fat ass up now! <laughs> 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 You want to fight, huh? Come on! out with Kasajian people you tell me and now they want to kill you I didn't do anything you didn't do anything you're right there in the middle of a shootout a cop gets killed where's your boyfriend I don't know he had to know about this no he would do that because he loved you right Jokers were? This agent's mom. Who's on the other side? Hard to tell. Bit of a one-sided fight. Neighbor say anything? How about what you'd expect around here? Did you see or hear anything? <sighs> no, I wish I could sleep as soundly as that. Can't say that I blame him, though. I don't think they're coming back. Looks like they've cleared everything out. No kidding. 
So what do you think it all means? You know what I think? I think it's two less scumbags on the street I got to deal with. That's what I think. Okay, thanks. You got that, Jimmy? I'm close up. Oh, wait a second. Whoa, hang on, Helen. Come on now. You're not going to use that on me, are you? Well, I may have to unless I get something better. Oh, come on, Helen. Porters. Wait a second. Hang on. <clears throat> a full-scale police investigation is underway to put an end to this senseless violence. That's great. I'm sure one of those quotes will work. Oh, you wouldn't do that to me, would you, Helen? Oh, oh come on, Helen. As far as I am concerned, I never saw you. And if I did see you, I didn't know you. If I knew you, you forced me to do it. Yes. But you, you can stay as long as you want. You one hell of a friend. Yeah, a lot of good has done that for me, being a good friend. <laughs> What am I supposed to do here? Stay alive. This is your fault. What? You grabbed me out the car. You want to stay there and get shot at? That's why they're after me now. You don't get it. You're messing with my life. You want to take on the whole world and be my big bad brother. And now you've made me a target. Well, I didn't know. Billy, they all think I snitched. It's your fault. And if that's not enough, I got the press breathing down my neck. I gotta take you off the case. Oh, that's bullshit. Who else is gonna handle a case like this, huh? Anybody. Anybody who's not a walking time bomb. Look, it was my sting, my responsibility, and he was my partner. And the animal that did this to Wallace, he's mine too. You don't give a damn what you kick along the way. Look at you. Look, I screw up, you got my head on a platter. Until then, you give me a chance to do it. Come on. Hey, turn this up, will you? I want to hear this. Besides, I'm the only guy who's seen the guy. Oh, no. Oh, you didn't talk to her, did you? I didn't talk to nobody. Rossi! Get out of my way. We spoke with Metro Police Detective Frank Rossi. A full-scale police investigation is underway to put an end to this senseless violence. Police have also denied... That's a hell of a job, Frank. Mount Forest Cemetery that was the dullest clip I've ever seen. They're never going to have you on TV again. They were found with fractured yeah, skulls, got it under control. Lungs, and numerous really? Injuries. Channel 3 News has been assured that police you action up the men we sent. For Channel 3 News... I guess you sent the wrong men. Thanks, Helen. Helen will be back at 10.30, keeping us up to... What do you know about this man? He's her brother. Some brother. Find them both. And kill them. Hey, you know where I can find this agent? This agent? No, no way. Okay, thanks. Man. I need to talk with this agent. Right. Hey, gee, this agent has a hit out on my sister. You knew I could find it. No, sorry, brother. You know Gantry? No. Cassasian? Uh-uh. What about you? Look, just get the hell out. You listen, I know Cassasian owns this hole. You tell him to take a hit off my sister, or he's dead. You understand? Get the hell out of here. Ah! <laughs> 
It's Frank. Just a minute, Frank. Hi. Hi. Oof, maybe I caught you at a bad time there. No, I was just taking a bath. Come on in. <laughs> Frank, that is so sweet. Come in. Don't come any closer. Don't. What's this for? They sent me to kill you. Go ahead. Do it.
round up the boys and do a number on our friends' head. Hey, dude, it's Chaka says check the brother with the hood. Special, huh? <laughs> well, go ahead, hot dog. Try that smart ass kick again, huh? You're coming with me, man! Come on, move your ass! Who the hell are you anyway? Move, move, move! Get in here, go! Hurry, hurry!
You're gonna tell me your deal with Kasajian's mob now. Or you'll shoot me? They got a hit out on my sister. You did a hell of a lot of damage there, mister. Just protecting my home and family. things. Cover me, man. Sorry, boss. I tried to get them to hold their fire till after the 11 o'clock news, but you know these kids today, they got no damn respect. Something I want to show you. There. See that? You had your dead. You were reloading. Your clip was out. There's one in the chamber, man. You sure there wasn't someone else there? Helping you? <laughs> hey, come on, Lieutenant. How often does someone jump in to help a cop, huh? And next on the Headline Report, we go to the streets for reactions from concerned people. So, who is the guy with you at the rail yards? <laughs> well, there wasn't anybody with me. At least nobody on my side. <laughs> oh, yes, there was. How come you didn't use this? Actually, I hadn't seen it. I went over the outtakes frame by frame today. So who is he? A vigilante? There's no such thing as a vigilante. Maybe. But I'll bet he's the same guy who took Kasajian squad down in Kensington Market yesterday. I think I've got one hell of a story on my hands. One man, one unstoppable man, against a whole crime syndicate. <laughs> Everybody loves a vigilante. Yeah, everybody except a cop. I can't keep this under wraps forever, Frank. If you won't tell me who he is, then at least tell me why he's doing it. Remember that girl in the bar last night? The one the fight was over? Yeah. That's his sister. Kasajian wants her dead. So now Kasajian has got a war on his hands. Couldn't happen to a nicer fella either. <laughs> so you happy? We're even now, right? I'm gonna find that girl. Helen? What, you don't think I can? Now, don't take this personally. But stay the hell out of police murder investigations, will you? The only thing you're gonna do is get yourself killed, and there's no Pulitzer Prize in the world that's gonna be able to bring you back. Then work with me, Frank. I can't. Why not? Because I don't know how far I'm going on this one. Should have killed you when I had the chance. You can never kill me. You love me too much. Oh, yeah? Mm hmm. <laughs> Baby, we can't stay here forever. Then we'll go someplace else. And they'll come looking for us. For a while. Then they'll give up. What about your brother? He 
He's gonna go nuts. Attention! I want Jared back! You hear me? We don't need none. Jatan, huh? Frank Jerry Jatan. You can't come in. Now, you don't really mean that, do you? What if I was to tell your parole officer that uh, you were working for Kasajan? You'd be back bending over for them big boys for another three years now, wouldn't you, huh? No. No, no. You... You're dead. Come on, huh? You want to fight? Come on. Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up. Find me! Find me, Doc! Find 
you want to fight? Are you finished yet? I haven't even started. You want to be dead, huh? Isn't that what you said? You want to be dead? Well, here's the chance of a lifetime. No! You're under arrest. You got the right to remain silent. Then you say, can and will be held against you, court of law. On what grounds are you torturing me and my employees? On the grounds that this subhuman murder and scum killed Officer Frank Wallace right in front of me. But I'm sure that the state prosecutor will spell it out for you in much greater detail in the morning. I doubt that you will have him quite that long. If you'll excuse us. His name's Charles Bender, better known as Shaka. Book him, assault, murder, anything I'm you want. I'm Mr. Bender's attorney. We'd appreciate the paperwork on this as soon as you can manage it. Get out of my sight. There's no need for that, Mr. Rossi. We all have a job to do here. I can see you've been doing yours. You call what you do a job? Let me paint you a picture, mister. Back off. Yeah, a man. No, 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 a piece of garbage. Takes a knife and guts a helpless police officer. Are you understanding what I'm saying to you? You gotta prove that. I saw it. Come on, Frank. It's not worth it. He'll be out of here tomorrow. I guarantee it. Shut up and draw. I want Tara back, you hear me? I want Tara back. We don't have her. Who are you? One of you will live. I don't care which one. Who are you? One of you will live. It's just me. Let me out. You tell Cassidy and hold my sister back. Yeah. And he's next. Right. <laughs> Somebody just trashed another of Kasajian's fronts. Wonder who that could be. Well, did your office get the message from the police scanner? No, cops probably don't even know yet. Oh, that's terrific. Uh, maybe we should just close down shop and plug 911 into your beeper, huh? Come on, let's go. You know, the word on the street says you're next. But don't worry, Mr. Kasajian. I'm not worried. You. You should be worried. Find him. Find her.
killed them. Hang on, whoa. What happened? You came to get the girl. We didn't have her. Who? We didn't have her. Get him out of here. Look, we don't even know if cassage has got the girl. Well, you're vigilante. I'm a mean, concerned citizen. Thinks he does. I want to find her before he does. Never happen. I've got a hundred people with their grubby noses as close to the ground as they can get. If she breaks cover, somebody's gonna know. Hey, girl, can you spare a cord? Sure. There you go. Ah, oh, thanks a lot. I got a message for Miss Helen. It's Skeeter. He walked before you had your breakfast. He's a cop killer. What do I got to do? Kill him with my bare hands to get him off the street? I hope I'm not hearing you right. He's out there laughing at us. You're off the case. For what? You lost the drugs. You lost the money. I got a cop on my hands. Everybody knows that's a personal vendetta. You know what that adds up to? No, you tell me. You know, people are saying you know who's knocking over Cassagian soldiers and letting them run. Now, I'm not saying that, but God help you if I find out you've turned vigilante on me. Now, get out of here! Yes, sir! I think it's called, uh, Central Wrecking. Right, you mean that junkyard on Polson Street? Polson Street, yeah, yeah. It's just a front, man. It's just a front for a chop shop. That's has been for years. Well, if you can dig up anything else cassation has got his paws into, I'd appreciate it. Frank. I know I owe you. Yeah. Okay. This is the only way you know how to say hello. Hey, well, you become a very dangerous man. <laughs> Why'd you shoot the other guys? 
Because I had to shoot somebody. It was a tough choice, buddy. Well, what are you going to do? What am I going to do? I'm going to take you in. That's what I'm going to do. Take me in for what? There's been a traffic jam down at the morgue ever since you got involved in this damn thing. That's for what? Man, they got my sister. They're going to kill her. So you're going to start a war? Yeah. What would you do? What if they had your sister or your wife? You can't keep doing this, man. I'm going to walk away. Don't do that. Hey. Don't do that. Hey. Hey! Stop! I don't have a choice. You do. You can either let me find my sister, or you can shoot me right here. Hey, I got a job to do, buddy. I'm going to do it. My sister saw Chuck and kill your partner. What exactly are you trying to say to me? What I'm trying to say is you don't want to shoot me. Help me. We're both on the same side. You've got a message from Skeeter. Thanks, Claire. Hey, Joe, hold three minutes for me. What do you got? I can't explain now, but I'll be back for the 10.30. Trust me. We just wanted to be together. And then it all went crazy. They're all flipping. We ain't going back to any of that. What about your brother? I'm worried about him. He loves me, but... I can let him know that you're all right if you want. <laughs> That'll be a great help. We're going to start over again, just the two of us. Somewhere where... No, Tara. I don't want to know where you go from here. So what are you going to say about us on TV? That you want to be together. To love each other away from all this madness. Maybe Billy will understand. Thank you. Is it going to be on tonight? Yeah. I'm going to be on TV. I got to tell you, after all the trouble you caused, Cassation's going to use Tara to get to you, man. And what if she's already dead? Look, most of Cassajian's businesses are drug fronts operated by gang members. Well, what is this going to do with my sister? A lot. Tonight, young lovers caught in the crossfire. Every day, we discover more victims in this vicious gang war that is terrorizing our city. It's enough that you're dealing with a 611 power forward. Willie, put that back on. From the field, and, you've got yourself a tough man. in a small room just moments ago, I spoke with a beautiful young woman, very much in love, but also very afraid. Oh, I cannot no. show you her face, and I cannot tell you where that small room is, where they would be killed. What's up, man? All they really want is to be together. And yeah, this is Detective Frank Ross. I want to speak to Helen Wolinsky right now. Who's Helen? Shut up. A young couple like this that I know she's on the air. Get her off now. Who's Helen? Thanks a lot. We got to go. Move. Right, lady. behind the news and you didn't tell us you didn't tell us where romeo and juliet are tune in tomorrow <laughs> oh, God. don't fuck with me all right you don't understand you don't really believe that i'm gonna break your arms one at a time when you get to know me a little better you'll tell me 
Where's Helen? I don't know. She's not answering her pager. Now, gentlemen, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. You stupid bastard. Why'd you let her do that story, huh? Where'd she find the girl? I don't know. Helen didn't tell me. She wouldn't tell me. She never tells me anything. Who'd she get her tip from? People phone in here all the time. Maybe her messages. You call them. You do your reporting thing. You find out where they are. You tell them you got money for them. I don't care what you got to do, but you get over there and you call them now. Now, please. For Christ's sakes, get on with it. We got to get out of here. What do you think? Yes, you did. No balls or brains, huh, Shaka? Shut her up! Kasajian wants the war to stop. It's her brother you want, not her. He's next. No, he's not. You can't get him. He's beating you all over town. My guess is if he keeps it up, you're a dead man. Shut the fuck up. You kill her and you got nothing to use against him. You're back to square one. Is that where you want to be, Chaka? Oh, Kasajian will love that. Shut up! I'm trying to think. You got a nasty mind, lady. I'm right. We're all going to go for a nice little boat ride. Come on. Grave freighter at the spit. Hey, that's Helen's car. up there? If we don't, we will. Is that the best answer you can give me? Come on.
a six shooter. I want an automatic. Chrome. I look like Santa Claus to you, huh? <laughs> Let's get out of here, man. Son of a bitch. He's processing his own drugs. Come on. I'm not Roy Rogers. I'm not gonna shoot my way in and shoot my way out. We need a diversion. Come on, follow me. Something's wrong. Huh? Something's wrong. Well, you're the expert. Take care of our guest, Mr. Kasaja. Haven't you already taken your best shot? Well, actually, I haven't even started. Oh, you son of a bitch! 
I'll kill you! No, 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 no. This is really most refreshing. I think I'm going to enjoy this. Gentlemen, have fun. Mr. Gitano and I will be entertaining the ladies below. Don't forget to clean up after you. And throw out the trash. I'll kill you, you son of a bitch! Yes, sir. You're mine now! How's your memory? It's a little fuzzy. Let me refresh it. Come <laughs> on! 
Focus agent, it's not her you want. It's me. Throw the gun away. Let her go. Throw it away. Let her go. with all this mess. I think I'm gonna blame it on you. All by myself? It's a hell of a job. One man. One unstoppable man takes on a whole crime syndicate by himself. He comes in the night, destroys, and disappears. And disappears. Channel 3 will be here soon. No. Oh, come on. One time. No, no. 